gonna be a little bit of a problem. Oh my goodness. Okay, calm down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, guys. So I just got a call from my friend saying her dad caught a snake in the garden. He has no idea what it is. I have no idea what it is. So, I mean, the only information that he told me was it has a triangular head. So hopefully it is not a venomous snake. I'm not exactly sure what it is. Let's open this up. But first, I'm gonna have to open this for some light. Okay, so hopefully this snake is, oh my gosh, I am I'm pretty nervous and I am pretty uh, excited at the same time, I don't know, but I don't want to. He says it's really small, so I'm not sure what it is. Let's see, let's use this stick to, oh, okay, yep, it's not a venomous snake. I already know what it is. First look of it, I already know what it is, you guys. It is a wolf snake. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so he put in some charcoal. I don't know why, but there we go. He said that the, uh, what do you call that? The tail is a little bit injured. So yeah, let's see how his temperament is. Hey, little dude. Hey, what's up? You doing good? Yep, it is a wolf snake. Check that out. Super cute. I love these guys so much. These guys actually eat uh, geckos, house geckos. So yeah. Let's see, it's a small little guy. He said that the head is a little bit crushed, I think. I'm not sure how, but it seems to be pretty calm, actually. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, little cute guy. Super cute. There we go. Now, I'm not sure if this guy is gonna bite me, but yeah, this is not a venomous snake and it's super calm, like super, super calm. Let's, let's pick him up. This is not a venomous snake, so yeah, that's awesome. When he said a uh, triangular head, I was thinking maybe possibly a cobra or something. I don't know, but yeah, there we go. It's a little wolf snake. Now these guys, I have caught some that actually bite as soon as you pick them up, but there are some like this one who are pretty chill. They have a very, very placid personality, so that is awesome, but he seems to be tensing up a little bit. Yo, there we go. Super cute, man. He's super cute. Whoa, I'm so sorry. He just, he just slided off my hand. But let's, let's just examine his tail because he did mention that the tail is a little bit, uh, what you call the injured. So far, I see that the tail seems to be okay. So that's a good sign. I actually did have one, if you guys remembered. Yeah, that, that one actually passed away. I did get a few comments asking what happened to that one. Yeah, but that one actually passed away quite a long time ago because I went to the UK. And then I passed all my snakes to my friend and then he told me that one snake died and I was wondering what snake that was and then he told me that it was the wolf snake so yeah anyways we've got another one over here yeah it's gonna be a little bit of a problem oh my goodness dude yo yo okay calm down whoa 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 bro bro you gotta calm down man you gotta calm down oh my gosh these guys super fast look at that so yeah he is currently running away, but I should have this under control. Where is he? He's under my tiger. Where are you, little dude? Ugh, you were so slow before, and now you are being so fast. There he is. No worries, the tiger is soft, so. Dude, go. No, you're not going this way, man. Ugh, super nervous snake. Good thing it isn't a venomous one, though, so. Yo, you see, he's rattling his tail. So that is a defensive, defensive pose. Oh man, no, 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 no. He's going under my sofa. Ah, man, fun times, man. Fun times with snake. All right, I'm gonna have to get it out. But I can't see it, so. Yeah, I can. It's down there. Oh my gosh, that's no good. Ugh, I shouldn't have took it out of the enclosure. And I just said it was super like docile and stuff. But no, it's being very, very nervous. I can't see it now, so I'm gonna have to pull this thing out. Where'd it go? I am such a genius, man. But the good thing is, it's not a dangerous snake, so I'm not afraid. Let's lift this sofa up and see if it's, there it is right there okay uh what am i even doing seriously bro can you please not do this right now okay little dude what are you doing my friend oh these guys small snakes are super fast so oh dang it nope you're not going there come on 
Get out. There we go. We're all good. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm panting away. <laughs> oh man. Back in this little cage, I guess. Yeah, he didn't bite me. I thought he did, but yeah, no worries. Oh, that was fun. Yeah, super fun. Oh man, don't hate me for this. <laughs> but yeah. Super tired right now. I'm sweating. I'm literally sweating. All right, little buddy. Let's go release you somewhere that is far away from people. You're gonna go to a better home, buddy. Please don't come to human houses anymore. Because you're lucky that the one that caught you was a person that had sympathy for you. You may have entered the wrong house, buddy, and someone would have killed you. Damn it, there's actually people where I wanted to release this little dude over here. I wanted to release him at the pond where I fish, but there were people there, so I guess I'll release it in the jungle over here. A very, very dense jungle, so yeah, we will release the snake in the bushes over there. All right, I don't think I'll need my snake hook. Let's say goodbye to this little dude. Yeah, I think we'll release him over here. Very, very dense jungle all the way down there. So he's going to have plenty of spaces to hunt. Pretty sure there are a lot of geckos in this area. So, yep, this is the right thing to do, guys. I know a lot of you guys are probably going to comment, keep the little dude, but no, this is the right thing to do. Hey, little dude. See, he's rattling his tail. Being very, very defensive. Look at that, that's so cool. Oh yeah, that's these guys, defense mechanism. Even corn snakes do this, but don't bite me. I'm releasing you, okay? Be chill, be chill, be chill, okay. All right, so I'll put you in the grass over here. Oh my goodness, can you calm down, dude? All right, you go into the grass here, all right? And Hey, 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 you're terrestrial. All right, I'll put you here and then you be on your way. There you go, little dude. Straight into the dried leaves. Be on your way, buddy. There we go. Go on. There's a little dude. Go on. There we go. Yep, he's gone, you guys. He's gone. That is awesome, man. What an experience. I gotta go give this container back to my friend. He smokes, I'm being raped by mosquitoes, man. Oh my gosh. It is time to go home. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just a short little adventure. Look at mosquitoes trying to get in the car. Oh my gosh. Scratching ahead trying to figure out what to get your loved one or maybe just yourself for Valentine's Day? Well, we've got you covered. Let's forget about those chocolates. That's gonna disappear once you've finished eating them. Just for this February, we've got new merch design! <laughs> so this season's merch design will be of our beloved Saria Cosmos Elegance, also known as the Trinidad Dwarf Tiger or better known on this channel as the Heartbutt Tarantula. Yep, check it out. Links in the description below.